Hey, it's Holly and welcome to The Proper Pineapple. Today I'm going to share with you most of the stuff I got for Christmas and some stuff I got in the mail from you wonderful pineapple people. Um, and things from my best friend Al, which you'll see at the end. But anyways, so for Christmas this year I did not ask for yarn from most people because um, as you could tell from the 24 days of Destashmas, I am redoing some things and getting some stuff around my house. So I didn't really ask for a lot of yarny related things because I needed to get some organization done. And then I told them, gotta buy it for my birthday. Anyways, so um, I didn't get a lot of that kind of stuff. So, but I will share what I did get in case you are interested. Um, I, uh, sorry, my phone's vibrating. It's Al. Hi, Al. If you're watching. Okay, see, reading your message and not doing a video. Oh, gosh, okay, I'm sorry. Anywho, so um, I'll start with uh, my mom. Um, when we went to my parents' house on Christmas, and it was fun. Uh, she got me um, a blanket and some matching pillows for my bed. They're really cool. They're like furry and fun. I love them. She got me some makeup. She got me some chocolates, which Mr. Pineapple ate like all of them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just ate them. It was she crazy. got us chocolates. And she got us a box of chocolates and he ate them all. I got to smell the container. <laughs> it's not true, you guys. I didn't let him smell the container. Anyways, <laughs> I, and she baked us cookies, so thank you so much, Mom, for baking us cookies and stuff. He didn't eat uh, those either. <laughs> oops, he didn't know about the cookies. Anyways, so that's what my mommy got me, but she did get me some ugly Christmas sweaters because you guys know I love ugly Christmas sweaters and I wanted to share those with you. Uh, the first one is this one. It is this amazing Santa. Look at him. He's got glasses. Like, he's so cool. <laughs> it's just this hideously ugly Santa. I love him. And I'm going to wear him so much next year with the rest of my sweaters. I am going to be throwing my sweaters at Mr. Pineapple because I've got quite a few, actually. And she got me. You guys, if you follow me on Instagram, you'll saw that I changed my sweater that morning when I got this one and put this guy on because unicorn and it says believe in sequence look at it it's so cute isn't it me i love it so that's the two things my mom got me i had to share with you guys thanks for the sweaters mom they'll be going to good use now let's talk about what mr pineapple got me um first off he got me some chocolates chocolates and more chocolates <laughs> there might have been a second box of chocolates that i don't know <coughs> What happened to you guys i don't know how i haven't like just killed over dead i've had so much candy this month it's ridiculous and mr pineapple one of the he did give me some stuff for christmas which i'm gonna show in a second but first i want to show you the ugly sweaters one of the things a gift he gave me was right after christmas we went to walmart and bought the a, a couple ugly sweaters on the sale prices which i mean is just smart so first one is this one it jingles <laughs> It is, okay, so for starters, it's got a hood that looks like a Christmas tree and it jingles. And the front of it says, fa la 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 llama. <laughs> I died when I saw it. I was like, yes! <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Oh, and before, Mr. Pineapple did get me um, four new sweaters from Target. This is one of them. Just a nice plain sweater with these cool bell sleeves. And he got me a couple of, but just, you know, nice everyday sweaters besides the ugly sweaters because, you know, I can't wear these every day. Okay, this one I love. And if anybody has this cat and wants to give it to me, just call me. But look at this cat. Look at her. Look at her. How, like, prissy is this cat? I love it so much. I would, I would die for that cat. <laughs> Mr. Pineapple was so excited about the idea of getting more cats. Okay, now this one was one of my personal favorites when I saw it at Walmart and I was like, I need this sweater. But I just waited until after Christmas. There's little bobbles everywhere, but they don't jingle. So they just kind of clink together. It's this one. It says, I can't tell if you can see on camera. There we go. Merry Christmas. And the neckline and both sleeves have jingly jangly little like bobble things. And there's little tassels. And the letters all move. So <laughs> I was like, well, that's me all day, every day, right? Oh, oh, I hit Mr. Pineapple in the face with the jingle jinglies. <laughs> I love you. Have some chocolate. No, <laughs> Okay, and this one, loved it, had to get it. Look, it says, meowy, 
Cat miss. And look at the cat, guys. Can you see this? Is it getting close to the camera? Can I see? Look at the kitties. Look at how cute they are, you guys. There's no baubles on this one. I get this. <laughs> and last, but certainly not least, I'm not even going to say nothing because I'm just going to show it to you and y'all will know why I had to buy it. Okay, ready for this? Ready for this? Look at this. Yes, that is a pink flamingo. Yes, those are like fuzzy pom-pom sleeves. In, <laughs> isn't it amazing? Look, his butt is a pom-pom. <laughs> I might wear this guy all the time. People are going to be like, isn't that a Christmas sweater? I'm like, no, that's an all-the-time sweater. I don't care. <laughs> okay, and uh, two more things I want to show you that Mr. Pineville got me. The first one... Yeah, look at these guys. Aren't those the best earmuffs ever? Am I yelling? Because I can't hear what I'm saying. <laughs> They're amazing. Look at these guys. Look at them. They're just so booby. Cat on each ear. I know. Look, and it goes with my hair. Look at it's like twice the size of my head, though. <laughs> look, huge. I love them. Aren't they the best? Look at these guys. You guys get an appreciation for the pink fuzz. It's everywhere. They're so cool. Oh my goodness. Tell me you have a matching coat. <laughs> I have a pink fur coat that this goes with. Not really. The pink coat is a little uh, deeper of a pink and these are more of a, like a hot pink. So, But that's okay because I've got other coats I'll wear these with. <laughs> Aren't they the best? The best. Best gift ever. Hands down. Alright. I'm. You know what? There you go Kevin. <laughs> Kevin's going to rock those for us. <laughs> and last. But certainly not least, my favorite he surprised me and got me one of the Streamline hooks that we put in the giveaway. I was so excited because I don't own a Furls hook, but now I do. Um, and I love the one we put in the giveaway. But mine is like the opposite of the one from the giveaway. I'm going to hold it up here. Hopefully it will focus. There, come on. There we go. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? The one we put in the giveaway, all of the white was down here on this end and the tip was brown. And I really love this reverse with the cream at the top and the plain at the tip. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. These are made out of um, a resin, but they're really, really pretty and really elegant. And I love this. And it's a 5.5, which I could always use that size. I love it so much. Isn't it pretty, you guys? So now I got one. I was all sad, like, because he told me to go ahead and order one for the giveaway, and I was like, I don't even own a furls hook. What the? <laughs> but he got me one, so I'm so excited. So maybe I'll share some of my chocolate with him. But don't get ahead of ourselves. Anyways, so uh, now I'm gonna show you guys some stuff I got in the mail. I got lots of wonderful Christmas cards. I've been trying to post, post photos on those, but they're they're lining my archway and stuff. I love it. Thank you guys so much for the cards. I love cards. Um, one person, this lovely person, let me read your name. Michelle Cleese, K-L-E-I-S Cleese, and Hunter sent me a package full of candy. Didn't she ask you to say hi to Hunter? Is this the one? Is this the one? Uh, At the very end, you? That is true. It is you, Hunter. We've been talking about this all day. Okay, so hi, Hunter. How are you doing? I hope you had a Merry Christmas. You better be behaving too. She asked me to say hi to Hunter, which I am happy to do. I love to hear that little kids watch my channel. You guys sent us candy canes, chocolates, all kinds of stuff. And again, I, I don't know who ate them all. <laughs> <laughs> but I don't actually have them to show you. <laughs> That's the problem. But she did send me this cute ornament. It's a little snowman. And I think it does something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I had to turn that off, but we love it. <laughs> and she sent me this container that may or may not have been filled with Dove Dark Chocolates, but it is not anymore. <laughs> Thank you so much. I love it. I, I've been waiting to use this. Every time I ask her a drink, the last day or two, my husband's like, why don't you just fill your water bottle? I'm like, I can't. I haven't showed it on YouTube. And if I don't put it on YouTube, it's I didn't get it. It's just how that works. So now, I'm going to fill that guy up. Okay, I'll go here. Oh, I um, this I know I had gotten from the um, Get Your Yarn Wishes Granted. <coughs> I had asked for this adore, uh, like an enamel pin, and they sent me this one. And I know I put it on Instagram. Come on, camera. 
sometimes it takes it there we go it is a yarn ball cat and she is pink glitter isn't that amazing and now that i have shown you i can put it on my bag where it goes all right i had gotten a lovely little letter package from cindy spurgeon let me pull that out a couple things in the bottom here i can get them out okay for starters she wrote me a lovely letter with a pretty little card here and she sent me this little square with tassels i think it is adorable and um my daughter has called dibs on it for a rug for her dollhouse so thank you cindy you have just furnished my child's dollhouse <laughs> and she sent me this adorable little um button with a pineapple on it that says florida fresh she sent me a pineapple enamel pin with glasses on it come on focus you wanted to camera i saw it there he is he's so cool i cannot wait to put him on my bag i love it and then this is a beautiful it looks like handmade snowman ornament it looks like it's made out of some sort of dough and then maybe hand stamped or hand painted it is super super cute and it is going on the christmas tree now i know it's after christmas but it'll go into the box and it will be on the tree next year so thank you so much cindy i absolutely love it um i got a little package from ellen field from farmington minnesota minnesota how do you say that minnesota? No, I'm just <laughs> okay so she sent me a little letter and she had sent a bunch of these little packs of stitch markers to put into my giveaways so those will go into future giveaways here on the channel and I opened this so long ago, I forgot what's in this little velvet pouch. I'm about to find out, you guys. Oh, she sent me a little stitch marker she made. Okay, let's see if I can get this to cover my face and focus on it. There it is. It's a little heart stitch marker she made me. So adorable. That is going into my stitch marker collection. Thank you so much. Uh, this one said, Didn't, do not bend. It was from Dawn Clifford. Pull everything out here. Make sure everything came out. And Dawn sent me a bunch of little cutesy things. She sent me one of these little pineapple bags, which I have found are the perfect shape to put yarn cakes in, like hand-dyed yarn cakes that you wind up and then like tighten it up if you need to store them. So thank you for that. She sent me this little banner that says "Work That Crown," which <laughs> so true. I need a crown, you guys. We need. To, does anybody know a crown person? Because I need one. And she sent me this little. Um, pencil container thingy with pineapples all over it which is great i use these to organize just about everything so thank you so much for that it's i'm like looking through my stuff because i'm like i don't remember everything i got then i actually got two packages from um jessa jessica pittington jessica first off thank you so much for sending me stuff you are such a sweet off second you just love some tape, don't you? <laughs> like, I don't want to show you her address. But the packages are completely covered in tape. It was like tape palooza, but it was funny. It was cute and it was funny, so I loved it. So, Jessica, um, let me see if I can find the paper that tells me how old Jessica is. Because Jessica. 16 in British. Language. My husband says Jessica is 16. I think. Jessica, if he is wrong, you get to yell at him. <laughs> I can't find it. She had wrote me all these adorable little letters. And she drew the cutest little pictures. And she made me a couple of things too. And she has a YouTube channel. I am trying so hard to find all of the information. Because she wrote it on. I'm going to holding all of these. She wrote everything <laughs> in all these little spots. She drew the cutest. Oh, Alice in Numberland is her YouTube channel. You guys should check her out. What's her? My husband checked out her channel. What's it about? Um, is it like a well, gamer? She's, she's an artist. So she she's an artist, so she's got a lot of art. So first off, she sent me this wonderful collage here. Let me get, see if I can get it up. This right here, that's her. And she sent me this collage with some Christmas stuff. Here on the other side, she drew it. It can focus right there. A little pineapple how cute is this pineapple and then over here she drew me and squishy doesn't that look just like me and squishy oh my goodness i love it and then she drew some more stuff that i was just like blown away okay this one here it's just a kitty cat look at this cute little like 
silver kitty cat. How cute is that? Love it. This one. Oh my word. I love it. So this one. Okay, let's get to focus. There's Mr. Pineapple. He's got a unicorn horn. There's my monkey. And down here is Princess when she wore the little reindeer thing. And then I'm going to show you my absolute favorite drawing she did. I absolutely love this. I want, I'm going to frame this and put this up. But she drew me. Isn't this the cutest look? Can you guys see with the silver? If I put it at an angle, you can. I love this. This picture made me feel beautiful. <laughs> so thank you so much, sweetie. You are the nicest person ever for sending me this. I love everything. I just love looking at it. And then she made this little kitty cat. This adorable little crochet kitty cat. And she made a pineapple. And she added a couple of stitch markers for me. So those are going to go up on the shelf and your pictures. This one of me is definitely getting framed, but I really like the ones of the family too. You are a wonderful artist. You guys should go check out her channel. Um, Alice in Numberland. Alice in Numberland. Yes. And let me see. Is there, I don't know. Is there any information? Are you on Instagram? I don't think she sees me about that. Yeah, I don't think you did. So go check out her channel on YouTube, Alice in Numberland. And remember to be nice, you guys. She's a nice young lady just trying to get out there. I think you are an amazing yeah, she artist. Is on Instagram. She is? Under I Draw Toothpicks. <laughs> I Draw Toothpicks? Is that your Instagram handle? <laughs> if it is, I'm going to check that out because that's just a creative name. I love that. I'm going to put this over here. I don't want to lose it. So don't. So, okay, so that's all. So then, Princess, can you take this off the table? Sorry. I had um, this lady, I met her at Rhinebeck. And she um, sent me a wonderful package for the Get Your Yarn Wishes Granted. I had asked for just a surprise package. So she sent me some yarn for starters, hand spun yarn which was so sweet. So apparently she hand spun this. The first one is this one. It is so pretty. It is a worsted weight and my hair is already on it. <laughs> In Edwin Studios, is that your name possibly? Your brand? I don't know. Let me try to get it to focus so people can see it. Thank you. But look at this yarn. It's like Butternut and pink is the colors I would say, and it's got sparkle in it. I love it, and it is a um, worsted. She also sent me this whole little pile of minis. There's like this, oh man, like a burgundy, but a lighter burgundy. This one, I really love this one. This guy's like deeper colors, I like that. Uh, a red and a purple. Let me see if I can get them up here for you to see. There. Really, really pretty. And she hand spun all of this and was so nice to send it to little old me. And my absolute favorite one, and you guys will see why, is this one. It's got purples and blues and hot pink, which I don't know if you guys know I like hot pink, but I do. <laughs> there we go. Isn't that pretty? So, so pretty. I love it so much. Oh, but I popped the label off this one doing that. Sorry. So she sent me all of this wonderful hand dyed yarn, which I... I'm super excited. I can't wait to make something out of this one. I really, really can't. I love the colors. And then she sent me... Okay, I don't want to show this yet. So let me kind of like... We did. We met her and her husband. They were on their honeymoon. And they came to Rhinebeck and they met me. They were the sweetest people ever. We had such a nice time chatting. Um, and let me get the paper out because... I, there it is. I am so horrible with names, you guys. I'm just bad at it. But uh, Okay, her name was... Katie or Kathy? No, Katie. Katie. Make it still <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Pineapple's being rude. Yes, Katie. Katie Beth Nolan. Is that it? Look, she made this card. She put pineapple stuff all over it. I just loved it. I was like, that's hilarious and so creative. She sent me a bath bomb that she drew a little pineapple on. And it's, it's called Your Bootiful, <laughs> which I love. I can't wait to use that. And she sent me, was so nice to send me. Ugh. Ugh. I'm going to get rid of that box now. Ugh. Don't let it. We don't care. Okay. Let's see. So first off, let me start at the center. She sent this beautiful um, shaped Afghan book. 
Um, this one is so cute. Super scary um, Machimos, I think. Machi Muchi, Machi Muchis. They're so cute. I will definitely be, this is a knitted book, but I'll definitely be maybe knitting up a couple of these little guys. They're adorable. She sent this like helping hands, little knitted stuff for babies and stuff like that, which everybody knows somebody having a baby. Here is some, it's called Spirit Animals. This one's crocheted. So I will definitely be making a couple of these guys. I love little animals. Oh, little red bird is cute. Um, this adorable pattern. She sent a couple of patterns here for me. Uh, some wrap patterns. And then a book on garden. It says garden romance. And it's all these like wraps and little shrugs and tank tops. Really, really pretty. Let me flip it around and you can see a couple of the patterns on there. Really pretty books. Thank you so much for those. I look forward to it. And then, of course, she sent me two more things. One... Squishy, come here, honey. <laughs> this is funny. She sent me this adorable pineapple toilet paper cozy. So you put it over a roll of toilet paper, right? Which I'm going to use it for. But right now, it fits on my squishy like a hat. So <laughs> we just... He's my little pineapple. <laughs> it's a little crooked. Look at them. Tilt your head down. Show him. Tilt your head down. <laughs> down. <laughs> He's no good at that. <laughs> but we'll be putting it on the toilet paper now but I just had to show you that it fits Squish's head and then the best is she apparently got a teddy bear for me the trashing the house and she crocheted a little pineapple costume for the teddy bear how cute is that look so look he's wearing a pineapple he's got his little pineapple tuft there it's all the way around it is so adorable and yes my children have been trying to steal it now he's a part of the set. He just has to hang out there. Well, I'll move him where you can see him more. So that is what Katie sent me. Thank you so much. And I look forward to meeting you again sometime. I love talking with you and Ryan Beck. You and your husband were super sweeties. So last thing in the mail before I get on to one more little thing was from Sally. Sally, and I never know how to say your last name. Nero? I could be, let me check my phone because it's in, it's easier to read out of my emails because it's in my emails too. Let me see. It doesn't say. Sally, I'm really bad at trying. Anyways, we've been chit chatting back and forth, collaborating on a little something something and, and I will talk to you guys about that very soon because I'm, I'm almost done. But first, she was so sweet to send me a couple of things. First off, she sent me this amazing um, scarf she made. Look at that. It's a rainbow and my daughter is in love with it. So I'll send photos of her wearing this because she's basically claimed it. It's so pretty. I love it. It could be like a table runner. Maybe I'll just use it as a table runner. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Star, you don't get it. No, I was kidding. <laughs> she sent that. Then she was so sweet and she sent me two of these wonderful Mandela sparkle cakes in the color Draco which I love this. Look at this. this wait, cover my face because it's why is it trying to focus on the stocking? Yeah, because <laughs> that's something that we want to see. All right, there we go. Aren't they beautiful? So, so pretty. I will definitely be making something fun about this. That light needs to turn this way. I'm really shadowy. There we go. That's me. <laughs> Apparently we were lighting the hall. I don't know. Whatever, right? <laughs> Thank you for the yarn. I love it. And that was more than enough. But let me just make sure. Okay, she also sent. Let me read the card again to see if I can find, like, if she wrote her name. No, it's NGO. Sally Nago? I don't know. But I love everything you said. So she sent me a racer. <laughs> and it's got a rainbow. But okay, now. The piece de resistance, whatever, however you say that. And I opened this and I almost died, you guys. Absolutely love it. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna die showing it to you. She made me. <laughs> she made me. Look, it's a mini Holly. It's so cute. I was in my car when I got this. I wasn't driving. Mr. Pineapple was driving. And I opened the box and I unwrapped her and I was like, oh my god, it's so cute. Look, look. Okay, I'm going to get her close. Look. 
Look, it's me, right? Look, she even dip dyed the hair pink. She made this amazing little rainbow shawl. FYI, I want this in my size. This is adorable. She put me in a little skirt, little boots, and look, the arms have wires so she can like bend and hold yarn and stuff. And she sent ugh, gotta get rid of a little stand for her. So let me put the little stand around her waist and because glasses. and it glasses, guys. Did you see that? Look, she let me put her little feet where they need to be. Okay. Look at that. Look, she's got little wire glasses on, just like me. And a bow, a flower. She put a flower in her hair because I always wear one, unless my hair is in a ponytail. But look at her. She's just like, she's a teeny tiny me. This is so cute. It looks just like me. <laughs> oh, I think that might have been my thumbnail. Forget the poofy pom poms. This might be my thumbnail. Just look at her. She's so cute. Sally, I love her so much. You're going to see her because she's going to be here on the set hanging out with Kevin <laughs> look it's it's me I can just stare at it all day <laughs> so cute mm. I might be a little conceited anyways okay so now I guys I want to show you what Al got me she actually got me quite a bit of stuff because she got me gifts for my one year potiversary for being one year here on YouTube and for Christmas so and stuff for the kids too, that's and gonna be in there. yes that's gonna be and she got some stuff for the kids so Check that out. Here is that footage. Okay, so Al sent me and my family some gifts and we are going to open them right now. Right now we're gonna open up the kids' gifts. Al usually sends the kids books. Um, she sells, let's see, is it written on the side of the box you can see? Osborne Books. There will be a link down below if you guys wanna order some books. I love their books and the kids are always excited. Jason, are you ready to see what you got? I don't think they're wrapped, so I'm just gonna kinda look in here, get it out. And give it to the who it's for. Okay, no looking. Let's see. Chase gets. Don't look. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Chase, this is yours. Ready? It's a muddle book. Can I show the people? <laughs> so, this one's called Muddle and Match. And you got one of these last year, right? Yeah. It's really fun because we open it and you can start with a monkey or. You can change it to a beetle body, or and you could change around the heads. Oh, look, a zebra. And then if we get, look at this. Look at how crazy of an animal we just created. Isn't this adorable, you guys? And then there's a little story that goes with each of it. And the more you change it, the more your story changes. So it's really, really cute. Do you like it? Mm -hmm. And I got this one. Yep, that's the one you got last year. What are you going to say to Aunt Elle? Say right here in the camera. Say thank you, Aunt thank Elle. Thank you. <laughs> okay, he's gonna slide out. Um, Starlet, you're gonna come sit down because we're gonna go youngest to oldest here. <laughs> Hold on. Here's yours, ready? Here you go. <gasps> it's called. <laughs> Let's see if it'll show up. Little Sparkly Sticker Book. It's really iridescent, you guys. So. It is adorable. There's flamingos and ooh, look at these really cool Chinese dragons. Super, super, super cute. And then there's tons of stickers, right, Star? Do you love stickers? Oh, and there's a whole under the sea section to put your stickers on. Do you like it? Yeah. Let's show it one more time up here for the people. We gotta get nice and close here. You see the cover with the flamingos and the little fairies. Oh, it's so cute. And look at look at you guys. Lots and lots of stickers in there. Do you like it? Yeah. Okay. Say thank you. Thank you. <laughs> okay, Bruce, it's your turn. This one's for you. Go the door. An airplane book. Yay, show the camera. Gotta get nice and close. It is a paper airplane book. And show him some of the pages. Okay. He has gotten one of these before and he loves it. You fold, you get all this funky paper that you can fold into all these crazy different airplanes. Well, I haven't got this book. You did, yeah, he's got one before, but not this not book. This. Which one's your favorite so far? Probably Brianna. Yeah. Brianna. Here, wait, let's show him that. Okay. Oh, my favorite. Look at the bees. It's an entire, like, beehive page, guys, and you fold it into an airplane. That's so cool. Mm -hmm. And there's one more book in here for you guys to share. Is everybody looking? Yeah. It's a Christmas paint by numbers or finger I got, paint book. I got one last year. How cute one. this is. Isn't this adorable, you guys? It's got all kinds of activities you can do. 
It's just like it's the just one I got last year. Adorable. You make people? And you've got little finger paint, so we'll probably be doing a little finger paint later, guys. I love when Al sends the kids books because obviously we're homeschoolers, so we love any chance we get to like mm -hmm. read. And I know this technically is not reading, but this is arts and crafts, right, Bruce? Yeah. <laughs> he can see it now. He's got. Books. And now he's got his glasses. Okay, everybody. Give it, give him the dimple smile with the glasses. Okay. You see the glasses Thank you so much, me. Al. The kids love the books, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay, now I'm going to get rid of the kids and I'll open up my gifts. See, they're back here. And I'm going to bring in Mr. Miller. He's going to be part of it, too. I'm I'm Mr. Pineapple. All right, say goodbye. Weird. Show him the piranha. He likes the piranhas. That's pretty cool. Say thank, thank you. Thank you, Aunt Al. Bye. <laughs> All right, hold on for a moment, guys. I'm going to do something. Okay, so Al gave me specific instructions on how to open stuff. Um, first off, I'm going to tell you, I have two of these. Make sure there's no addresses showing. Two of these little boxes from Walgreens. What happened was is she sent me something, and they, I guess, lost it in the mail or something, so they mm -hmm. sent it again, and then they found it, so they sent me two of them. So, yeah, bonus. But she said open these last, and she said Mr. Miller or Mr. Pineapple can have one. Oh, okay. And then she so also sent me gift, this bag. <laughs> I can't turn it around because the Al's address is on there, and I don't want you guys stalking my friend. That's not Unless nice. it's a bad gift, then we will turn it around. Right, and if it's show a bad gift, Al, I'm putting the address out there, okay? <laughs> so she said open that one. But first she said... Oh, boy. Oh. This is heavy. I think it's the biggest box we've I gotta got make sure I cover her office, address yeah. to open this giant box first. Yeah. <sighs> so I'm going to turn it like this. I'm going to push it off screen with the address. You cut it open. Okay. And then she said it's all numbered. And he is supposed oh, okay. to hand it to me. Oh, I'm supposed to hand it no, to No, he's you. not supposed to. But why do I keep him around if he's not going to hand me stuff? Uh, that's true. That's true. <laughs> We don't I'm so excited! I love getting surprises, you guys. You guys have no idea. Whenever I get mail, I'm like, Oh, they have an idea. They've seen your videos. They know <laughs> how much you like to get surprises. Does it look cool? Let me see. Okay, you can't look. It's I gotta look a little. It's look, just guys. a piece of paper. This piece of paper. Ooh, Let's move the paper. paper. Hey, hey, hey. You're not supposed I to gotta look. move the paper. You're cheating. Oh, they're, they're all wrapped they're up. They're all wrapped anyway. Oh, boy. This is gonna take forever. So you got to unwrap these in order? In order. She says they're numbered. Oh, boy. I see number 17 right here. This is going to be a while. Al, what did you do? Oh, boy. You know, if I like to shop, okay. guys, Al likes to shop more than me. Okay, so I'm here's a number three. So we got three. Yeah, oh, it's so speedy. I just want to rip them open. Oh, this she is, says i got to go in order. Here's number, number two. two. This is exactly <laughs> the kind of stuff that Holly gets all excited about. Here. Oh, uh, there's cards. cards. She told here. me I had to read the cards first. So first, this one's from Ho or to me. I'm Holly, in case you didn't know. <gasps> oh boy. Oh, so cute. It says I am so oh, proud of you boy. for all of your accomplishments with your channel. Congrats on your first anniversary. Love you. God bless Al. Oh, and look at the cat card she sent you guys. Oh, she's way more of a cat lady than me, but we do love cats. And then she sent this one to the Millers, which is all of us, in case you didn't know. <laughs> It says, glory to the newborn king, J.R. Holly, Bruce, Starlet, and Jace. Rejoice in the love God has shown by sending his son to live among us. Merry Christmas, love. Al and her family. Look at this card. Is it going to focus? There we go. Yeah. Beautiful. I know it's after Christmas, but I leave my card wall up until uh, the first of the year. So mm -hmm. these are going up on there. Thank you, Al. You're the best. You could have just sent the cards though, Al. You didn't have to get me nothing. Mm -hmm. But I'm excited. Is this a number one? That's a number that one. That looks like number one. And it's in leopard paper. <laughs> <laughs> you guys know I love leopard, right? It's mm -hmm. my... Okay, Al. It looks like you went a bit tape crazy. Mm -hmm. Can I just lay off the tape, all right? <laughs> but it's okay. I'm not one of those people that saves paper. What is this? <gasps> it's a... One leopard paper. We're going to throw it over there. It's a big pineapple tablecloth. Look at this, you guys. Is it focusing? There we go. That is amazing. Okay, that's going on the table now. Who cares if it's yeah, summertime yeah. or not? I love it. <laughs> they love gifts. Number two. Number two. Look, she taped up every seam. Like, well, how yeah. am I supposed to get... That's what you do when you got a friend that <laughs> you want to make embarrassed on camera. Yeah, but I don't know if I'm going to damage it by poking holes <laughs> in it here. She taped it up uh, too. Uh, ooh. Okay. A pineapple ice tray. 
Or you can make other stuff out of this. You can make chocolates out of this. You can yeah. molds. That'd yeah. be fine. And then a super cute pineapple dish towel. Look at this. Isn't that pretty, you guys? Cover my face so it focuses. Cover his face. Cover our faces. There we go. <laughs> Ew, this is nice. Mm -hmm. I love the colors in this. It'll go great with my new tablecloth. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Al. And number three. Kind of heavy for its size. Oh, she left me a little spot. Oh. <laughs> that was an accident. I'm this sure. paper doesn't want to... <laughs> Terminator paper. Did you buy me gag paper, Al? Yeah. That's not funny. <laughs> okay. It's this little pineapple pouch that I love. So cute. so cute. I think I've gotten one of these before, but the children keep stealing all my pouches, you guys. Ooh, what's this? What it's a letter H? What are these? Oh, it's stationary with an H. Uh -huh. Because I'm Holly. And it's pink. Ooh. Now I have to like write people cards and stuff, right? Mm-hmm. To be responsible. Yeah. <gasps> Look at this teeny tiny little notebook. You guys know I love <laughs> notebooks. It says, give thanks to the Lord for he is good. His love endures forever. Oh my gosh, I love it. It's got like a little thing to keep it shut. This is gonna be in my purse for like a little inspiration book. <gasps> I love it. Al, you know I love to scribble on stuff. That's so funny. They're so excited. I love getting presents. She really buried them in here too. She, she did. Them, like, She's all mixed up. She put them at like one They're on really the bottom. Oh, and oh, number four. Oh, Big look. one. It's teeny weeny <laughs> and it's leopard. Look at that paper, you guys. How iridescent it is. Oh my gosh. Can I wall, should I do my whole set, like the entire wall in this? No. I, <laughs> that sounds like work for me. Yeah, you're the one that's got to hang it. <laughs> yeah, I know. Oh my gosh, that would be so cool. But I'm worried about how the lights would react on an entire oh, wall yeah, just... of iridescent. Let's see. Pull it out. I don't know. I can't get it out because. Oh, beautiful. I can't get it out. <laughs> oh, it's a brooch, a pin, and it's a stunning. Yep, it's just a brooch back there. Oh, stunning snowflake. Is it going to cover your face, JR? There. If there's no faces, it will try to focus. Is it going to focus on it? I can't get it to focus. Oh, oh it's so pretty though, guys. <laughs> oh, I'm going to wear this with my shawls. I'm going to use it just like a shawl pin. Oh, it's so pretty and sparkly. Mm -hmm. Man. Sorry, guys. I'm just staring at my pretty spark <laughs> sparkly stuff gets my attention. <laughs> I'm like, ooh, it's so pretty. Number five. I think it's an ashtray. Because I'm a huge smoker. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I don't smoke. I've never smoked a day in my life. Never, never, never. I'm boring. I don't have any bad habits. Except for crochet. <laughs> and it's duct tape. candy. And, ca and chocolate. I mean, it's chocolate. <laughs> I'm a dig. But Cactus duct tape. Cactus duct tape. <laughs> now that is this something I she eat. would waste money on. I <laughs> I mean, bye. Bye. That was funny. Yeah. Look, it's cactuses. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm going to duct tape everything from now on with cactuses. <laughs> no, one day I had these boxes that I bought left for duct tape and I decorated them and I had those boxes for years. What is that? This is weird. Feels weird. It's it like feel rubber weird. gloves or something. Oh, well, it probably is rubber gloves. <laughs> I need rubber gloves. <laughs> okay, quick sidebar. I don't like my hands to be wet. Like, it, it's like a thing. I don't like moisture between my fingers. Blah, blah, blah. It drives me crazy. Mm -hmm. So like doing dishes, I have to have rubber gloves. Mm -hmm. The only problem is, is my kids like to use my rubber gloves and then they get water down in the glove. And have you ever tried to dry a rubber glove? Impossible. Okay. So now that I'm done with my tangent about rubber gloves and wet fingers, <laughs> I'm going to finish opening my package. <laughs> but I, I could use some rubber gloves. <laughs> I don't even know what that is. <laughs> I know you know what it is, apparently. <laughs> this needs a little backstory. Do you remember two years ago, or a couple years ago, we were going up to Al's house to visit her, uh -huh. and we stopped at a Goodwill, and we found this hideous cat, hideous skirt, cat skirt. Yeah. And we gave it to her. Al doesn't wear skirts, you guys. But it was this hideous cat skirt. And so then she came down to visit us that summer. She wore it, right? Yeah, she wore it. And, it came down. and she just sent it to me. Look. <laughs> she don't plan on wearing it again. So. Al, you're not going to wear this? 
I'm gonna wear this, you guys. Look at these cats. Look at these. We'll get it to cover our face here. That is lovely. Isn't that amazing? They've oh, got look like at the blue ones. He's wearing a tie. Oh my gosh. <laughs> wow. Okay, guys, I will put a photo of me wearing this wonderful skirt. This thing is amazing. I think it has pockets. It has look, pockets. It's still got a tag in it. She never took the tag yeah. out. <laughs> Al, Al wore it and left the tag in, guys, from Goodwill. So Tell the truth, Al. You wore it that one time, and yep, that was just it, one right? one time, that was one it. One time. I would have wore this sucker every day. Mm -hmm. I'm going to now. You guys, wait to see me in this. I will put some Instagram photos up of me in this. You should probably wear it to Rhinebeck next year. Right. <laughs> should this be my Rhinebeck skirt, guys? <laughs> you have to make a matching I should sweater. wear this. I'm going to Chicago with Al in April. Maybe I should wear this. Yeah, that, that's what you do. Wear it to. Oh, that's so funny. Now, I, I might as well not open anything else because nothing beats that cat skirt. Yeah. <laughs> because honestly, I debated between keeping it and giving it to Al because it was just so cool. Yeah. <laughs> that's hilarious. <laughs> I didn't even realize it was the same skirt. Yeah, of course it is. That's so funny. Okay, what is this? Oh, cute. It's little embroidery things. So she got a little. Let's get really close to the block out our faces. A little embroidery pineapple kit. An owl, because if you guys know Al, she likes cats and she likes owls. Let's let it focus. There we go. And then I'll switch it before it unfocuses. And she got a heart. Oh, my kids are kicking over my stuff. Sorry, you guys. But I've been wanting to learn to embroider, so these are going to be great to play around with. I really mm -hmm. want to do this little pineapple. I might let Star do one of these. I don't know. Or the boys. We'll see. Probably not. I don't share well. Number eight. Number eight. I love the leopard paper. <laughs> I, do, I, do, I love, you can't get into the gifts. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Oh, like my sister does that. She like, woo! Socks! Okay, these are the best. What is that? Is that like is that a pineapple turtle? It's a, a dinosaur? <laughs> like pineapple a dinosaur? <laughs> pineapple dinosaur and it looks like the pineapple things are coming out of its butt I don't know what to See tell. Spikes in the <laughs> I wear these all the time it's a pineapple source and then, and then she said flamingo socks but uh -huh. the pineapple with the green tuft coming out of its butt is the best <laughs> where do you even get these socks Al these are great oh my goodness and it's winter so I need long thick socks mm -hmm. Thank you. Oh, uh, what number was that? That was number I'm going to wear these socks with my cat skirt. That's what I'm going to wear. <laughs> this is a number nine. Ooh. I, I'm a little scared to keep going because yeah. I mean, cat skirt, weird turtle pineapple socks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. <sighs> this is what happens when you have best friends for far too long. They mm -hmm. get you all the crazy. <gasps> oh, more socks. More socks, you guys. Look, 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 look. These. Pineapples. These now, are the okay. socks you would buy. These are the socks I would buy. I always wear shorties like this. But in the winter time, I do like the long ones. Yeah. But I do. I always wear these shorties. But look at these ones. <gasps> and then look. Some flamingos. <laughs> and more pineapples. <laughs> and these pineapples say, hello, sunshine. <gasps> ooh, 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 look. Watermelons. I love watermelons, <laughs> too, you guys. Look, look, it's got little glasses. So cute. And then the last pair. More flamingos. I love these. I will absolutely wear these socks all the time. Mm -hmm. Because you guys know, I love socks. I don't have any desire to make any. But I want to. <laughs> I want to own socks. I want to own lots and lots of socks. Ten. ten. Oh, hell. I like excited. I don't know what's in this. All the crazy mm -hmm. she sends. This one was double wrapped. Yeah, double wrapped. Mm. What in the world? It's a squishy. <laughs> it's a pink llama squishy so you just take it and you just squish the tar out of it and then you wait and let it reinflate they're like stress relievers <laughs> pop somebody had sent me that pineapple one and now i have this awesome llama like, uh -huh. i wonder how flat he'll get really has he took that pineapple one from you <laughs> Cindy Marsh sent us the pineapple. Oh, yeah, Cindy Marsh sent me. Cindy, I got a llama to go with my pineapple. <laughs> Look at I made him flat. And then. The other one's slow. The other one's fast. Hours of fun. Hours of fun. <laughs> I still. What does that smell like? Birthday cake or yeah. something? What does that smell like? Oh, that. That's interesting. That is interesting because it's got the smell of scented, like, yeah, something. Like birthday I cake don't almost, know. But like... then it's also got the scent of. Mm. 
squish, squish, squish. Manufactured foam. So <laughs> Foam a weird combination. Yeah. Foam? Yeah. Look at him. Look at him. He's skinny. Mm. And now he's getting fat. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm gonna have hours of fun with this ale. You have no idea. This if I one? can keep my dog away from it. Do not drop this one. It's kind of heavy. When have I ever dropped anything? Yeah. Like I'm a clumsy person. Yeah. Mm. This, this papers. <laughs> what kind of tape do you use, Al? Because I kind of feel like people could patch drywall with this stuff. My pineapple duct tape. Right. Cactus duct tape. Cactus duct tape. Ooh, another yeah. little book that says, pray more, worry less. So true, you guys. <laughs> pray more, worry less. I love this. Love, love, love. And then she sent these, are they pens? Beautiful floral. Get it to focus here. There we go. Beautiful floral pins to go with it. Mm -hmm. Oh, I love it. I absolutely love these books. I really, really do. I absolutely love them. Thank you, Al. Oh, that was which one? I think that was 11, right? Was it 11? My cat ears are... Look, one of my... That, is it the sign where my stones fell out? I gotta go glue it back in. There's number 12. It's 12. We still got a few in here. I know. Because Al's the best. What is, what is this? I'm, I'm a little scared to continue unfolding this. Oh, it's a bag. Oh, it's like a backpack. And it's got pineapples. What is this part here? Oh, it's just like... Okay. Waterproof or something. Yeah, it's got two pockets. So it's got the big one. And then on the front here, it's got a zipper pouch. <gasps> I'm going to take this to yarn festivals in case it rains. Yeah. Look at that. It's waterproof. And then you can like... Whoop. I love you wear it. wear it on your back. <laughs> you wear it on your back because I don't care. It's so fair. Yeah, I have it. <laughs> I'm like a pack mule. He's like a pack mule. Let me go to the <laughs> I love that. That's really cool. And it does look waterproof. I wonder, is it waterproof, Al? Hmm? Do we know? Yeah. I don't know. I'll have to go try. Yeah. Yeah. The last thing you want is your hand dyed yarn and get it wet. <laughs> oh, I love snowmen. Oh. See, so she got me an Olaf Pez dispenser. <laughs> Yep, that you looks like something wanna build you need a it. snowman? <laughs> Everybody needs okay. pets, you guys. Plus, okay, and there's a side note that Mr. Miller doesn't know. In high school, one of my nicknames was Pez. I really have no idea why, oh. but it was. Okay, this one's bubble this wrap. Bubble so wrap. This is... But this is the next one. Yeah, don't drop that one. Don't drop the bubble wrap. Okay. okay. Uh, side note: Who loves bubble wrap? I do. Mm -hmm. Okay, you, now it has something on it. Oh, it just says fragile. Did you guys know that bubble wrap was originally created as wallpaper? Mm. Uh -huh. I can't do Really? What a dumb invention. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's a good invention, but wallpaper? Wallpaper. <laughs> well, Silly Putty was invented to clean wallpaper. Yeah. I'm smarter than the average blonde. <laughs> Not really. And she is filled with, with worthless information. <laughs> <laughs> it's true though. Yeah. <laughs> oh look! Oh, that's cute. Oh, you guys! It's a snowman. It's a coffee it's, it's mug. A, it's a s'more snowman coffee mug. Oh, I don't drink coffee, but I'll drink hot chocolate out of this in a heartbeat. Uh -huh. In fact, you were just talking about. I was about just talking about. I need some hot Christmas. chocolate to be sipping mm. on. But we had that at Christmas, so yeah. we're gonna have to get some more out. And get this guy going. I'm gonna uh, put him back here because I don't want him to get broken. That was 14, I believe. 15. I wonder if this is something to beat the kids with. I'm kidding. <laughs> it's yarn. Yarn. I don't know if you know this, but I like yarn. Oh, oh my wow. gosh, this That's is yarn. gorgeous yarn. <gasps> oh, what is that? Something wools. AJHC Wools. Oh my goodness. And this is a DK and it's called Neon Rainbow. Oh my goodness, you guys. Look at that. Oh, it's just stunning, isn't it? Yeah, it's pretty. Oh my goodness. Al. That's one you would have picked out. <laughs> I would have absolutely bought this. Oh, it's so soft and pretty. And I am going to go. They have a website. Let me see if I can get the label up for you guys get it to focus there we go see right there go to their website you guys check them out 
I know I'm gonna go because this is stun. Oop, look, blurry, blurry, blurry. blurry. <laughs> I, this is stunning. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to make something out of this. Mm -hmm. I think you're gonna like this one too. You think? Uh huh. Just hold that place. No thanks. <laughs> you know what, what it feels like, yarn. Mm -hmm. I like yarn. <gasps> oh, look at this. This is by Mint Rain Hand Dyed Yarns. This is so pretty. It's a sock yarn and it's called Witch's Brew. Oh my mm -hmm. goodness, let me see if I can kind of like ball that up to get it in front of the camera here and cover our faces. There we go. Look at that colors, you guys, with the green and the purple. And then there's the logo. Roll it around. That is them. Go check them out. Oh my gosh, this is stunning, isn't it? Mm hmm Wow. I can't wait to make something out of this. So pretty, I got yarn. Can I just hold the yarn to my face now? No. But I want to hold the yarn to my face. I know, but there's two more, I think two more in here. All right. And this one. Can't do it open, you guys. We're almost getting tired of opening gifts right, right now. Almost kind of I'm just done. I'm just not going to do it. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <gasps> it's more yarn. <gasps> oh, they go together. <laughs> oh, my. Oh, my God. Do you remember this yarn jar? Uh, yeah. Al, did you even know this? Was Al in that booth with us? I don't know what you're talking about, but yeah. sure. Okay. At Ann Arbor Fiber Festival, we went to with Al recently. If you didn't see that, go back. There was a lady... Her store was called Matier. I will show oh, you in a second. Yeah, yeah, I and I there. fell in love with this one color, but I had just gotten back from Rhinebeck, so I had no money to spend. This was the color. <gasps> oh, I love it. It's called Sherbert Surprise. Oh my gosh. This is the color. Yeah. This is the best gift ever. I wanted this so bad. But like I said, I had just got back from Rhinebeck, and I found way too much money. But look, okay. So this is the name of the company, if we can get it to say it. Yeah, I know you can find them on Instagram. I follow her, so you can do totally follow her. I love this color. Oh my goodness, I cannot wait. I'm gonna make a shawl out of this for sure <laughs> because I saw this. She was, remember the funny story yeah, yeah, lady. She had, a she had all this trouble, right flat there. tired, <laughs> and had trouble with her booth and everything. It was her first time ever being at a festival. And I festival asked her. She... This was sitting there, and I said, "Oh my gosh, I'm in love with that color. What is the name of it?" And she goes. I haven't even named it yet. And I said, okay, <laughs> let me give you a piece of advice. Get good names because good names are the best. And she named it and it's so pretty. <gasps> oh my gosh, I'm so happy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so happy. This is my favorite. Aw, that was too nice of a friend. Okay, one more. And this says, read the tag about the company. Read the tag about the company. Mm -hmm. Okay, Al. Yeah. I shall read the tag about the company. I can do that. I remember how to read. Uh -huh. Oh, it's two things. Two things. And I'm looking for the tag first. Maybe it's in this one. The smaller. Let me pull them out here. Mm -hmm. Is this the tag? I think this is the tag. It is called Marion Sailor. And let's see. Let's read this. Thanks for visiting the Tasty pastry toy shop our pastry pets are handmade fresh daily for your enjoyment please consider following us on instagram facebook it would mean a lot to a little toy company like ours okay i have seen these guys and they make the cutest stuff look mm -hmm. at this enamel pin you guys <laughs> get that to block our faces first and then it will focus it's like a chocolate cat donut enamel pin you guys i'm gonna okay let me put this tag in front of the white bag and hold it up. That should help it focus on it. Look at that. I will, ow, I opened my table. <laughs> I will link them down below. I have followed them on, um, I think Instagram or Facebook. I cannot remember which. This is my favorite enamel pin ever, right? And if there's a lot of noise, it's because okay. our five-year-old has already taken the box that all these came in Look. and made it into a boat. <laughs> Look, is that the same story? Okay, okay look at this. It's a felted donut cat. You guys, where's that white mm -hmm. bag again? It helps to block out our faces. Look at that. 
it's like a felted <laughs> donut, donut cat. cat. <laughs> oh my gosh, I love this. This is like my new favorite thing in the entire world. Mm -hmm. Felted, let's see. Strawberry mini donut cat. Mini donut cat, a pastry pet. Oh my gosh, I love this. It says handcrafted <laughs> in Seattle. Oh my gosh, yeah. guys. You have to go check them out. They really do have like the cutest stuff. I've been like looking. Oh, that's a donut cat pin. I didn't... Yeah. yeah. Where's he been? Yeah, I was, it's a chocolate I'm sorry, donut I'm... cat pin. My little donut cat. I love this so much. <laughs> he's so soft. I'm gonna find somewhere. To... I'm gonna take his little tag off. I'm gonna mm -hmm. find somewhere so he's like right here all the time. Mm -hmm. You can make a Christmas Al, tree. Al, you know. are like the nicest, bestest friend ever. I'm not gonna say how long me and Al have known each other because then it makes us both seem old, but she's like family. Yeah. She's, she's better than some family. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah. Yeah, better than some of our family. <laughs> I'm, I'm kidding. Yeah, we love our family. I love you, They family. just don't like us. No. I love you. Okay, and then she told me to open this bag, which again, I'm not gonna flip it around because the gifts were good, so you don't get Al's address. Yeah. Sorry yeah. guys, no stocking Al. Not today. Yeah. We'll see if she makes me mad next week. Yeah. Okay. I don't want to cut anything. I don't know what it is. <laughs> so trying but these little mailer bags they like really pack stuff in there good one of these days i'm going to be doing an opening video and i'm going to cut a finger off that's what's going to happen yeah. one of my viewers sent me one of those like nice little things to cut stuff I no idea where that is yeah. <laughs> it's just oh my yeah, son there found it is. good i can there. use that in a second okay get this mailer open <laughs> okay careful the address there okay careful She's not going to cut her finger off. What she's no. going to do is she's going to cut open one of these skeins of yarn one day and cut it right in half. I'm going to die. I would <laughs> die. Oh, look. Hey, look. I don't know what this is, but look. It's got pink glitter tape. Do you guys see the pink uh -huh. glitter tape? Mm. That's how you do a package. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> What's this? What is that? It's a bag. Is that <gasps> Cheshire Cat on it? Or is that it's a Cheshire. I think it's Cheshire. I'm going to call it Cheshire because there's teacups oh, and yeah, laughing yeah. flowers and there's the mouse. <laughs> okay, for starters, you guys, it's from Kim at Chasing Acorns. See the little, I don't know if the, whoa, 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 one of my kids is that, playing no, with the camera. That was, that was uh, your Dad? big kid husband there. The biggest kid was playing with the camera. Sorry, children. <laughs> Anyways, it's from Kim from Chasing Acorns. You've got to go check her out. I will link her below. And look at this bag. It's got Cheshire. Cheshire is so my favorite in the entire world. And it's got teacups and laughing flowers. <gasps> and look at how big it is. I could put all my pretty yarn in it. <laughs> well, bags are only good if you could put yarn in them. Yes, so we have yeah. to look at all this yarn, you guys. And I can get more in there. That's true. I guess if you can't put yarn in a bag, it's not worth it. I love this so much. It's got Cheshire. I've been wanting a Cheshire cat bag for a while now. Yeah. They're hard to find. At least they're hard to find ones I like. I have never seen this pattern. And look at his little face. Oh, that's neat. That's neat. Face. Isn't he cute? Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now I've got to open these two cubes. So I'm going to just give it a quick mm -hmm. run around. Are open them both at the same time? Because they're probably time. the exact same thing. Because we're right? thinking they're the exact same thing. Unless somebody else sent me something from Walgreens. Does it say who sent them? No, it just says Walgreens. Oh, it says they come from Walgreens. Oh, okay. So hold that one. So they might be the same or they might not. Yeah. We don't know. Al didn't, oh, Al doesn't even know if they both are the same thing. Yeah. She doesn't no. know if she thinks there was a mix up and we've got both. Well, there was definitely a mix up because they told her it would be here on a certain day and it was not here. Oh. Okay. So she called and I'm sure she was super polite to the people. I don't think you got mine cut open all the way. I don't think I got mine cut open all the way. Because it's, it's hard to see the seam in places. Yeah. Eh? I definitely don't have mine cut open. Guys, this is what. 20 minute video on how to open up a foam box. <laughs> I'm almost there. Almost. Oh, yeah, boy. Okay, ready? I'm ready. Okay, pull it apart carefully because obviously. Pull it apart. It's a coffee cup. Mine's a coffee cup too. <laughs> oh, they are the same. Oh, it looks It's yummy. got us on it. It's got all the coffee. Oh, it's got the puppies. Yeah. Look, okay, Puppies. let's see if I can get this up close. Bruce holding the puppy. Okay, wait, cover your face. Oh, okay. <laughs> Tuck or something. Here, we'll go like this until it focuses. Does that focus? Look, look, look. It's got yeah. Star and Bruce and the puppies. And then if you spin it, here's me and Mr. Pineapple. The kids on Halloween, little squishy, and my buttons. Oh my goodness, I yeah. love this. 
And it's good we have two. It's, yeah, it's yeah, good that I'll it's use pink. this. I mean, yeah, it's pink. Oh, look, it's got one of your, is that your pattern in the background? Or? I think that is a dishcloth I made. I made a rainbow uh -huh. dishcloth. It's in the background. I love it. Oh, Al, these are so great. I love personalized stuff. That's and now, sweet. Mr. Pineapple could drink hot chocolate with me with his pink cup, too. Yeah, yeah. Right? <laughs> oh, yeah. All I need is a cup, and I'm in I'm right, in he doesn't hot care. chocolate. Hot chocolate. Hot cocoa yeah. all day. Do marshmallows or no marshmallows? Uh, either way. Either way. Yeah. We fall on the either side yeah. on that one. Okay. I just have to say thank you so much, Al. All yeah, of this thanks, is so Al. great. The yarn is amazing. I cannot believe you got that material. Matier. Oh, I got a text message yeah. from you, Al. You're texting yeah. me right so you now. You know we're filming a video, Al. Al. <laughs> Professionalism. I'm filming a video. <laughs> oh my god, I love it all. And I'm going to wear this next time I see you. Should uh -huh. I wear this to Chicago? How weird would I be in Chicago wearing this skirt? You should definitely wear that Chicago because <laughs> I won't be in Chicago. <laughs> oh, you don't want guys hit on me? Don't want me to look good? No, I just don't want to have to walk around a festival with you wearing a cat skirt. <laughs> At least he's honest. Yeah. It'll go do great with want, that sweater. Do you guys want? <laughs> do you want me to make Mr. Pineapple a shirt out of this? No. I ain't enough material to make me a shirt. There's a lot of material here. Actually, it's a really long skirt. Look at this thing. It, that's yeah, but that's not enough to make me a shirt. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness! I'm so excited. Uh -huh. I gotta go put my pineapple tablecloth on the table. That's what we have to do right now. Yeah. Okay. We need. Al that. Not yet, Jace. Yeah, Jace, Jace is trying, trying to, to shut the camera off. Like, he, he likes to help. <laughs> we are done filming. Done. We've had enough of mom and dad. Done. Turn it off. <laughs> oh, okay. This was so much, and I love it so, so, so is much. Is that it for this That's video? That's it. This is it. This is just, we've opened Al's gifts, and then it's going to be in the video with all the other stuff I got yeah. for Christmas. But I yeah. love this okay. so much. I can't believe you got me a Cheshire bag and the yarn I wanted. Mm -hmm. And all these coffee cups. These are really special. These are really That's special. Nice. Especially since have... it's got that Halloween one where I made Jace that... Yeah. I fun. spent 24 hours making 40-some pom-poms and my hands were killing me, you guys. I think I might have carpal tunnel from it. Yeah. But <laughs> it's so cute. That is cute. That's a good picture of us, too. Yeah, it is. I look good. Uh-huh. It'd be better if I was more in the center and you were kind of off. Right, just push me. Except for I'm the one that looks good. Like, so if you cut it right there. <laughs> yeah, sure. Okay. All so right. Tell Al thank you. Thank you, Al. Even though it's my You're gift. You're a great friend, Thank Al. you. I love you, Al. And I can't wait to see you again. <laughs> Bye for now. <laughs> see you later. Aren't I just the luckiest person in the world? Al is my best friend in the whole world, and I absolutely love her. And if you guys are interested in um, Osborne books, Al sells for them and I am hosting a party um that will last from now until February 1st and I'm sorry my pom-pom things have gotten little fuzzes everywhere my nose is so itchy so anyways one itch all right back to the story the party will be going from now until February 1st and there is a link right down below in the description box and um any book sales over $75 will be entered to win um, a $25 in books and free shipping and handling. Um, Al will take care of all that. And the $25 you can um, get for your children or you can donate that to a charity in books. It's fine. Also, if you order before February 1st, you will get your books before Valentine's Day. So please go check it out. You will be supporting my dear friend Al, who I love and I know a lot of you love too. The link will be the very first link down below. I super excited i'm definitely going to buy some more books because i love those muddle books that jc got i just love those those are so fun for little kids because it's a different story every time you read it anyways and the yarn al sent me was amazing i cannot believe she got that mateer yarn i wanted but anyways i could sit here all day chatting about how awesome al is which i did in that clip you just watched so i gotta get out of here get this place cleaned up because it's still a hot mess after Christmas and now I can take down the stockings and the tree and put everything back the way it goes. <sighs> Thank you to everybody who sent a card or a gift or anything and if you sent something and it did not get into this video um stay tuned till my next podcast maybe I didn't get it in time and I just haven't been to the post box because you know with the holidays so I will get down there hopefully it will be there if not we will figure something out. Thank you guys. I hope you all had a wonderful Merry Christmas and I hope you guys have a wonderful, safe and happy new year. So until next year, no, I'm just kidding. I'm going to be back before next year. I got at least one more video coming out. So bye guys.